This guy would just get out of my face. <laughs> Trying to do our intro <laughs> here, dude. <laughs> Who knew that getting a llama would be so much hassle? Huh. Welcome back. To Medieval Minecraft. I'm Dragoon. And I'm Dirk. Thanks for watching. Well, I think we need to change our tactics a bit. Uh, running from the dragons is obviously not working. Um, and if you look back here a little bit underneath this boat, uh, we've gotten an advantage here. Uh, it looks like it got caught in a boat while uh, chasing dirt. And <laughs> now we can harvest it and uh, build some better armor. Should give us a much needed advantage against them. And then we think we can take the fight to them. Yep. I've spotted a couple nests that we can hopefully pillage. Revenge. Yeah. Let's get to it. Cool. Uh, why don't we get this guy's scales first? Let's see, and I think you have to be like totally unarmed, right? Yep. There we go. Inventory space, I guess. Best. There we go. Cool. I thought Let's the ship would go get. back up, but I guess not. Maybe you have to get inside or break it. I've got ten bones and a heart and some dragon flesh on me. Let's see. Got the skull. Got fifteen black scales. Um, I think that's it. Yep. During the week, I also found a, a dead one inside of a city. I think a, a guard took care of it. And Must be the, some guard. Yeah. Uh, it was just sitting there when I got there. So, took advantage of it. Mama um, is really really nervous about you being on this ladder it <laughs> nearly pushed me off the ledge trying to get to you swap the buttons out with pressure plates because buttons are terrible ways to keep a door open yeah yeah not only is the pulse so short but it's so easy for them to not trigger when you need them to <laughs> i think i got stuck at the door for like 30 seconds and said, that's it, I'm going to break a tree. <laughs> um, if you come this way, got a little bit of an organized storage system going. Not quite as organized as it can be, but from venturing out a little bit, I've got some redstone stuff, food, uh, building blocks, doors, random bits, weapons and armor, mostly dungeons gear, some enchants, maps, and uh, ours books. Nice. So, take what you think will help against the dragon. Ooh, a shielding totem? and a regeneration totem. I should probably take those. Or at least one of them. Mm -hmm. Grab some dual crossbows. Sounds like a good one. I really like the chest piece that I have. And the, the pants too. Iron leggings with protection 6 on them. The helmet's pretty good too, with 15% chance to negate hits. So maybe oh, yeah. you should take these and make yourself a set of dragon scale armor. That way you get. Uh, tell me twice. <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty sure I remember them doing extra protection against breaths. Plus, if I remember right, they were 
about the best armor you could get in Roguelock, so they should be pretty good here. Oh yeah, get. this is looking great. We'll have to try to get a Mending Villager. All right, this is definitely my color. <laughs> and Ooh, I think wow, we yeah. definitely have enough for another set. That looks really cool. Thank you, thank you. Let's see what we have enchant-wise. Not much. Not much lapis either. When I think the enchanting bench is definitely different. I know these could be applied at the forge, but... Uh, yeah, there's a, a special mod in here. I forget which one, but semi-automates it. You could use hoppers to put items in from the top and uh, I think lapis from the sides and pull the enchanted item out through the bottom. Oh, that's going to be great. And I believe you still have to click the enchant so it's not fully automated, but it is pretty nice to skip some steps. Well, just have the lapis in there. It's, it's great. Oh, yeah, and it's, uh, I guess, a, a change from the last time we were here. Uh, they updated the mod and they added Tetra. So, oh, I yeah. have to make a, I need to make a Tetra pick. Yeah, we'll have to get that taken care of, too. I believe with Tetra you had to make a, a wooden hammer and smack a, a crafting table with it to turn it into a Tetra crafting table. I think you're right. There's a couple back here. Or underneath here is another. I was gonna do this one here, I think. And turn them off. <laughs> we got the dungeons, or the wonderful wheat. And even when it's not in my hotbar, he, he respawns and comes teleporting right to my face. <laughs> He's like uh, that mob from, uh, God, what was that? Skyrim, I think. the Or no, Oblivion is the adoring fan, I believe. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. I haven't found a use for this guy yet. Besides looking cute and holding a coin. Yeah, that <laughs> is pretty cool. Oh, I got a literacy bag. Let's see if we get something. Nothing. Okay. Oh man, okay. So it looks like you can pair with uh, some iron. I know we definitely have some. Oh, I'm on the llama. No, oh, thank you. It's not just my way he's getting in. He spits on me too. Whenever <laughs> I stand between him and the thing he's, he's uh, spitting at. Yep, definitely need to play around with this some more. Yep. Oh yeah, we also made these. I don't know that they would really stand up to a dragon, but uh, these domesticated spiders, they spawn string. And uh, there's some other different ways you can improve them and turn them into some cool mobs. So we'll want to play with these more later. All right. Harvesting the strawberries and I'll be ready to go. Hmm. Warp scrolls. Not sure how to use them though. Use while sneaking to set a location. It'd be handy. Oh yeah. What? 
Why don't we each take one? I recorded it right at the base of these stairs. Hey, hopefully it's not a one-time use thing. <laughs> I'd imagine it probably is, but it's still more handy than not. Yeah. Uh, the closest one is actually the way we're headed. Okay. Wait, I see some sparkly yellows. What is it? Oh, it's a ghost. Yeah, that was your first boo. Yeah. Real sneaky. Yeah, I, just I, was black. I saw him invisible kind of creeping up. It's uh, nighttime. Do you think we should go sleep first? We're brave. I mean, I feel like we're going to fight this dragon regardless. Yeah. Let's press on. All right. He's up this way. Maybe we'll catch Release up. Release his nest is. Oh, that's where Optifine's off. Can't zoom in. Oh, uh, you should be able to actually. C should work. Nope. Uh, check your bindings then, because it works for me. Hmm. Is that the dragon in here? No, phantoms. Oh boy. I don't know, man. Fighting phantoms while fighting a dragon doesn't seem like a very good idea. <laughs> Maybe we should sleep. I take all the fun out of everything. All right, all right, let's go do it. Okay, there's chests there, so that definitely is his nest. Oh no! What? what? Burst into silverfish! Oh no! <laughs> Took out oh, the dog! The wolf. What? That dog survived the boat dragon! The only one out of like eight guys! Jeez. Kangaroo's attacking him. Did you tame that guy? Uh, no. Huh. Oh, I must have made the phantom go berserk and hit him once. It's the special enchant on this chest piece I've got. Wild Rage 3. That's why I like it so much. Yeah, when that I, sounds great. There's these Hydra mobs that have like multiple heads like in the Hercules movie, or when you kill one head, more form. Mm hmm And I, I hit one, and it made all the heads start attacking each other. Oh, it was, that's it was awesome. pretty hilarious looking. Nice shot. Special creeper. Oh, okay. Got him. That lightning rod does AOE damage, apparently. Oh, okay. Yeah. Greek lady here chased after me a little bit. She gave up real quick, though. Ooh. Reinforced iron helmet. Just an uncommon. It's an yeah, great. You can strip the, uh, the specialness off of that and put it on something else. That's true. Oh, I got two enchanted books. Altruistic, where I can heal allies around me, depending on how much damage I take. And Explorer, for every hundred blocks, I get a little health back. Not bad. Let's check this guy's chest while he's gone. Terrorizing the countryside somewhere else? Yep.
He's gonna be mad when he comes back. It's on him. <laughs> Golden apples. Probably should have stocked up on that before heading out. Oh, yeah. Oh, look, there used to be a little Seder camp here. Oh, yeah. Then the dragons came. Went. All right. Well, should we make our way to the other nest? Slowly. Yeah. Chop has a mentor over here. Oh, these <laughs> desert bandits. Yeah. What is that? Phantom. More phantoms. They sound like dragons. Gray or drop bear? Just poof. Yeah, he just poofed. That's happened to me before. I was watching him and then he just disappeared. <laughs> Alright, which way? Um, this way. The way we're headed. Back by that hole that you tried to save yourself in last episode. Oh yeah. <laughs> Murder cave? <laughs> hey, your body turned back into your body. Last time I was on it was not your body. And very confusing. Hot person. Yeah. There's a drop bear down there too. I thought you went down to kill it. No. No drop bears allowed. If anyone's going to eat my corpse, it'll be me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nope, 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 nope. What is that? Uh, they were a lot greener the last time I saw them, so I don't know if yeah. that's just something different. Charred bone. That's cool. Another grave. Golden apple in there for you. Boots. Definitely take one of those. Those plants just gave me mining fatigue. Looks like it got you too. Must be the berry yeah. one. Wister bush. Watch your step through here, I guess. <laughs> With all this ash flying around, it feels like the dragon's been here already. Yeah. It's dragon land. What's left of it? Yep. Here's the uh, the city with the what is that? Okay, uh, the city that had the dead one in it. And there's the Chad Golem right there. <laughs> Hero of the city, I think you mean. Right. You messed for that dragons right behind the town. At least I'm fairly sure it's that dragon's nest. Because it hasn't come back. And across, to me. across the river here. Oh, tried zooming in again, can't do it. But right there is another nest. There was a dragon sleeping in that the last time I passed it. Copper dragon. This guy was into the cheap stuff. Make sure you got your items on your bar. Check this literacy bag. At time I was slapped with a salmon, volume four. 
I mean, who could forget? Lost the saddle. We've got some of those back at base. Gave a couple buckets, so that's uh, a handy thing. Let me split that and I'll give you one. Fill that up with water. Oh yeah, <laughs> get rid of some of those uh, flame effects. Yep. Okay. Let's go this way. Oh, I figured out that there's chests on top of these too. Oh, that's cool. These little half-built uh, oblivion portals. Yeah. I think I looted this one. Yeah, there's still some stuff though. So do you think this one's home? Oh, what was that? Oh. Jaguar? Well, I'm away. Friendly? He appears to be friendly. I like the mountain lions. Left me some maggots. Sad I missed it. Oh, there he is. There's hyenas over there, too. I feel like those aren't as friendly. They haven't attacked me yet, but that was back when I was having the connection issues. Oh, yeah, that dragon's there. Cool. You're leaving a llama behind. Oh, it just disappeared. Turn my back for one second and it's gone. Yep, that's how llamas are. Untrustworthy. And very sneaky. There he is. Alright, you ready? Wait. Uh, hold up. Um. It's a couple golden apples. Right, we've got three total. Like that. And some strawberries. Let's pop a golden apple. Let's roll. All right. What's up, idiot? We just poisoned him, so he'll take it that extra damage from us. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> I thought he just disintegrated. <laughs> I don't think it's that easy. Ooh. Oh, we got him. No way. That was easy. Man, I wonder if it was always this easy. Yeah. <laughs> All right. High five. Oh, whoops. Still have my thumping stick. Power shaker. <laughs> <laughs> it was uh, that Ars Nouveau book really helped out. He was uh, coming after me, and then all those orbs hit him, and he just shot up in the air. Oh, did he take tons of fall damage from that, maybe? I don't know if he took fall damage, but he's, it certainly got him the heck away from me. Yeah, maybe it was the combination of that and the, the poison that does extra damage on it. Um, there's a hex on him that causes them to take additional damage from all sources. Well, I'm a big fan. Alright, well, let's part them out. Yeah. Let's see. Okay. Hey. 
And if we didn't before, we definitely have enough for two sets of that armor now. Yeah. Yeah, I think we do. Grab the iron ingots. We'll be needing a bunch of those for the item storage. That was a stage three dragon. Not bad. Thought maybe it was just a just a kid, <laughs> but nope. <laughs> we don't kill kids. No, <laughs> but dragons get kid dragon. Oh yeah. Feels good to have some vengeance. Yeah, I think we're pretty safe in this area now. Can't be more than two nests in close proximity, right? Foreshadowing. I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> I hope not too, but <laughs> we'll see. Yeah. Another graveyard. Yeah, and a portal to check out the top on. I have no blocks anymore on me. Nope. I guess I can put this water up here and swim. Yeah. That's a big brain move. Uh, golden Ho, Unbreaking Six. No, seven. Cool. Golden Leggings of Burning, a stalwart chest plate. Boost skin talisman. Source gems. I think we'll need those. Oh yeah, we gotta have to figure out these snacks. relics. Oh, cool. I, I think this will stack well with other things. There's one... I can't remember if they're potions or not, but um, there's things where you, if you eat something, it affects and boosts other players. We should definitely cool. take that back. That was one I liked on the, the Dungeons game. Yeah. Yeah, seeing a lot of familiar names. It's really cool. Yeah, that is really nice. Alright. Let's see how the scroll goes. And oh. I'm back. And it does use it. Ah. Oh well. I'm Good sure to we'll know. find more. Yep. Well, that was... Very successful. I can't believe that went so well. Yeah, I'm pretty dumbfounded by that. Here I was thinking we're not prepared enough. I'm dead within the minute. <laughs> three wax and he's dead. Oh, there's more than three. I was uh, underneath him oh. pummeling his neck. Like a a ninja face mask in there too? No, it, but I, I think it, the skin kind of ends up looking like that. That's cool. <laughs> Except for the way the nose kind of overlaps on top of it. It's a very, <laughs> just very gonzo type look. Yeah. <laughs> People that wear their mask that way. Yeah. Tuck that nose in, sir. No, no, no. It's, we're not doing that whole pandemic and Minecraft business. <laughs> All right. Well, guys, I think that's going to wrap this one up. Yeah. Next time we'll have to do some base work. Yeah, I think uh, I think we have just about enough to start the simple storage network, and it's you can see as all the loot starts to pile up, we're definitely going to need it. So I think that'll be next time. Have a good night. Bye. Bye. Yeah.